Morning. About an hour before I have to be at work, so whip up some oatmeal. brisk this morning. Here's a cool little hack that I picked up during my time living in all these vehicles. When you don't have a measuring cup to figure out how much water you need for your oatmeal, just grab the package and fill it up halfway. And there you go. To that line is approximately four ounces of water. All right, tea kettle is on. While that's warming up, time to make my bed. All right, water's ready. Woohoo! I'm just gonna let that run for a little bit and warm it up in here. Enjoy my oatmeal. When it comes to van or suburban life, is that everything that you need is within reach. I don't have to go stumbling out of, the, out of my bed, go into the kitchen, make myself some coffee or any of that crap. Today, because it's an early day, I won't have time to go to the gym to take a shower. But yeah, everything I own is within easy reach for me. So I'm going to finish up my oatmeal, get dressed, go get me a coffee and uh, show up to work early. Put my dishes away. All right, so before I head out, I've got to do my dishes because that is something that I found that if you don't stay on top of, it becomes a lot more work later. One thing I failed to mention also in the video yesterday is that this is an awesome way to conserve water. All right, now that that's done, Let's get some coffee. What do you say to that? I forgot something very important. Stink and juice. While I'm at it. I may be homeless, but I've got class. Let's do this. Looks like I'm not the only one that had that idea. Still have plenty of time before work, so I'm all right. How do you know when you have a Chevy? When your right blinker doesn't turn off. It's a Chevy thing. All right, thank you very much. See you guys on the next one. So she ended up hooking me up with a mudslide, and I was like, I was like, no, 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 I gotta, I gotta work. And she's like, no, silly. Huh. But all oh, the memories that flashed back. Woo. Okay. The line was a little longer, so I'm not quite late, but later than I want to be, I guess you could say. So I gotta rush in there. I will see you at my lunch break. Bye -bye. We are, we are getting slammed. So 
Um, but the day is going by quickly. So I need some bread. I need some bread. Um, I'm gonna get some cheese and I'm just gonna make a simple ham, ham and cheese sandwich. Maybe I'll grill it, maybe not. So we'll see. So I was smart this time and uh, got myself some cooking spray. I didn't know there was so much different cooking sprays just to make sure that things don't stick on your pan. Uh, I mean, what's the difference between quinoa, quinoa, coconut, olive, and regular cooking spray? I mean, seriously. I mean, does it, like, is it a flavor thing? I ended up getting olive spray. It was the more expensive one of the options, but I'm figuring olive oil is really healthy, so I don't know. I, I can't figure out half this crap. I could take the lazy way and not bother with a grilled cheese, but I'm trying to be, I'm trying to be not so lazy so, uh, when it comes to my cooking, so it's happening. I do know well enough not to spray cooking spray near an open flame. So, so if I spoiled your fun, I'm sorry. What I like about Lucky's is that when they have singles, so this is 99 cents, yeah, but when they have singles from their six packs or their 12 packs and they, they fall out, they reduce them and put them in a bin. So this was only 88 cents. All right. Not bad. It's the little victories throughout life that makes it worth it, you know? So I can make grilled cheese, grilled ham and cheese, So that was nummy. I probably could have gone for two, but I'm also trying to, I'm also trying to lose a little bit of weight. I wanted to uh, bring up the point that uh, all these products that you see that me using, none of them are sponsored. It's just me using these products. So just as a reminder, uh, tomorrow is my live stream where I'm having a Q&A. It'll be at 12.15 p.m. Mountain Time. And um, if, you have a, if you have a question that you want to try to get in, uh, just go into my community tab and the very on the first posting that you see right there, just go into the comment section and leave a question and it'll definitely I can guarantee that it's going to be answered but with that I am done with my lunch so I will see you right after I get out of work all right so I got out of work ended up going to a restaurant uh, to meet up with a, a few friends of mine a great dinner great conversation good people that pretty much wraps it up I'm preparing for tomorrow's live broadcast just picked up my Mexican blanket from Amazon. If you like these Mexican blankets, um, there's one vendor for $15 as opposed to the 25. And if you don't really care about the color, they'll randomly uh, send you one. You'll save yourself anywhere from $9 to $10 for one that you would want to choose. This is a good color. I, I don't mind it. And uh, yeah. Um, I hope you had a great day and have a good night. See ya.